Right, so it's 40 degrees out here, and it is absolutely boiling. We're in a place just outside of Vegas, and it's pretty freaky out here, it really is. It's a place you got to, you know, be wary about where you're flying, because there's a lot of, um, you know, privacy signs everywhere, so... This is all about flying your drone in extreme heats, and I mean extreme heats. Let's talk about it. Right. Today we're talking about the DJI Mini 3 Pro and how it flies in... I don't know if you guys can see that. It might be a little bit light out there. 40 degrees. Right there, 40 degrees. We're in um, Nevada just outside of um, Las Vegas. And, well, we've been filming a bit and I thought it might be interesting to show you guys how the Mini Free flies in this weather. And it's, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's already hot, <laughs> it's already hot. Um, let's get it in the air. Even the controller is, come on. Whoa. Right. Okay, there we go, that's us. Right there. There we go, looking good. All right, so it's hot, and I mean it's seriously hot. 40 degrees is centigrade, is, is temperature that, you know, I mean, out here, we get out of the car and it is, it is all over. It is really, really bad, but um, let's have a look. It, there's weird stuff flying around everywhere. It does a really nice job, and I've already flown quite a few batteries, so I'm not actually too bothered about it. <sighs> Alright, let's have a look. So let's just do a little circle. If, if you leave it in one place, it will overheat. I've already had that, just, you know, letting it do a time lapse, it just, it, it took a few minutes for it to overheat, so I would um, be wary of that. But just flying around like I am now, you know, just doing like a little bit of an orbit, that's pretty cool. Okay, let's, let's fly down this road a bit. A bit to the right, and let's go straight down. That looks nice, it's, uh, that car has made a lot of dust, so. Yeah, it, it, it does a good job, it hasn't got any problems, unless you leave it in one place. Like I said, doing time-lapse, I, I was doing a time-lapse, not a hyperlapse, it would just, you know, it would overheat. So you have to be wary of that. It's got no fan inside it, and it is air-cooled, so you've got to make sure that you are air-cooling it. Um, apart from that, I wouldn't worry too much. We've had it in extreme, extreme cold conditions, and we've had it in extreme heat, and it, it's, it's been fine all the time, so you're fine. In the cold, in the heat. I've even had it in snow and rain, but this film is mainly about 40 degrees. Yesterday it was 45 degrees in Vegas, and we flew it anyway, having a great time. There it is. And I'm guessing my camera will overheat before it does. And there we are. Looking mighty fine. So, wait a sec, let me just show you guys. Beautiful scenery around here, by the way. I think that's good for a, um, is that, is that good for a thumbnail? Maybe a little bit lower in between the clouds? Oh, there we go. Thumbnail, click. I think Luke's flying as well, should we see? How his drone's doing. How's it going? You flying as well? Is your drone overheating? That's good. Whew. Right. So what I'm gonna do is a little bit click at everybody. I'm gonna fly around a little bit more.
get some cool shots. Maybe like fly it through some of this stuff. Like, ooh. Nice and low. Oh yeah. It's not gonna like that, so just turn it on sports mode. Get it very nice and low and um. Woo. That way, it won't, you know, go up when you're trying to fly through stuff like this. Oh, that's much better. Oh yeah, it's kicking it now. If it hits anything, I'm screwed because there are probably rattlesnakes everywhere. And up we go. Woo! This is a lot of fun. This is a lot of fun. So sports mode, you know, if you're really nice and low, it's not going to hit anything. Um, and you're fine, you know, if it's not going to hit anything. Where is this drone? There it is. Oh, a little bit of a flyby. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Be careful out there, guys, and, you know, just get your shot. Right, a little bit of context to the um, farmer shots and me pretending not to fly. I've been approached on many occasions by farmers or angry residents that I'm flying around in America. So what I do now is I just basically put my controller down and pretend I'm just drinking water. Or cleaning my car. And that's how I kind of, you know, that's how I fly. That's the easiest way around it. No discussion. <laughs> 